Hey guys, and today I'm gonna see how many cookies I can eat in one minute. Liz, what on earth do you think you're doing? Nothing. Mm-hmm. Ah! Mr. Phil, guys, sorry, quickly I can do it next time. Hey, hey guys, guys and, and welcome, welcome back, back to YouTube Cookie Guys. Sibling sous chefs. YouTube Cookie Guy. Sibling sous chefs. YouTube Cookie Guy, okay? So Lance, what are we making today? Turkey burrito bowl. That sounds delicious. So, we will be making it using these ingredients. to prepare all of the ingredients as the rice cooks. Cook the rice according to the package directions. To yield about four cups of white rice, I use one and a half cups of uncooked rice and two and a half cups of water. But this may vary depending on your rice variety. So be sure to check that package. While the rice is cooking, add the ground turkey to a skillet and cook over medium heat until it is cooked through. Depending on the fat content of your meat, you may need to add a little oil to the skillet to keep it from sticking. Make taco seasoning using spices listed in ingredients section. Once the meat is fully cooked, add the taco seasoning and half a cup of water. Stir and simmer the meat and spices until the water reduces to a saucy consistency, about five minutes. Turn the heat off and set the meat aside. Thaw the corn kernels, rinse and drain, drain the black beans, shred the cheese, and slice the green onions. Once the rice is finished, fluff it with a fork and divide it between four containers. Divide the remaining six ingredients between the containers as well. These are the taco meat, the corn, beans, cheese, salsa, and green onions. Okay, reheat the bowls for one to two minutes before eating in order to melt the cheese and heat the meat and rice through. So, today, right now, you better be sure to like, to comment, and subscribe by clicking the red button. My hair's red, but it's not a button. Hello everyone, and welcome to the Burrito Bowl Buffet, where we make burrito bowls all day. Wait, is this now a full-time job? Because that's not what I signed up for. No, I'm just saying that's what it sounds bad. Okay. All right, Lance, start us off. Remember, 
You can customize your burrito bowl however you want. Just make sure you start with some rice on the bottom, but then put whatever else you want on top in whatever order you want. Show us, Lance. Now, after having visited the Burrito Bowl Buffet, we will now try our own personal customizations. Take a closer look and you'll see they're both very different, but I'm sure are both yummy. Let's take a try. Make sure to stir it around first. Okay, ready? Here's a bite with everything. Are you ready? Not quite. I've got a bite with it. Already, three, two, one. Mmm, mmm. Tastes just like a burrito. You should really go to Burrito Bowl Buffet. Well, maybe you should make your own at home because I think buffets are all shut down at the moment. Happy New Year. See you next time. Bye.